Hello everybody, good evening. My name is Satyajit and uh, today we are going to discuss one question from Indian society. This question has been asked in the recently concluded men's 2023 and uh, interestingly they have asked one question from a contemporary social issue. Of course, this question, if you first read out the question, the question is about children and their socialization, especially in respect to the mobile phones. Let's talk about the question first. Child cuddling is now being replaced by mobile phones. Child cuddling is now being replaced by mobile phones. Full stop. Discuss the impact on socialization so on the socialization of children. So this question has been asked for 10 marks. It's a very contemporary issue, and we are in our families, we are observing this issue is very relevant. And uh, UPSC has promptly noted this issue ki how the contemporary socialization or the, uh, the today's parents they are uh, uh, using mobile phones, and because of that, the children are using more, more, more and more mobile phones. And that's how what impact this, this use of mobile phones is on socialization of children that we need to discuss. This question was about 10 marks, and uh, uh, generally, you have to write about 6 to 7 or maximum 8 to 10 uh, points in this question. Let's first discuss what uh, impacts. It is having on the socialization of children. How you can introduce, by the way, on this question? Yes, you can introduce uh, with the help of the family and institution. Or uh, if you are observing some reports and data about this question, you can use that. And, uh, or you can uh, quote some average figures ki on daily basis, how many hours or how many minutes the children in India are using mobile phones, something like this. Or any case study can look. Ki, this this happened in this this, this uh, city because of use of mobile phones by children. Okay, some case study or any data or something. But the question was the the impact on socialization of children that we will discuss ki, how it is impacting the socialization of children. Okay, firstly, it is reducing the emotional bond. Earlier, uh, especially in our our generations, uh, when the mobile phones were not norms, mobile phones were rare. In that case, the parents used to socialize or parents used to cuddle, parents used to, uh, in different, different ways, they used to handle their children. And it, it led to what the development of the emotional bond, the one-to-one -one emotional connection was there uh, within the parents and the children. But that to that bond we are observing, it is lacking in contemporary society uh, because of use of mobile phones. And the use of mobile phones is uh, bringing some distance between the children and their parents. So cuddling and physical affection play a very crucial role. You know, very crucial role. Physical affection, hugging and all, is very important in socialization. It's very important to develop that bond uh, between the children and parent. And if mobile is coming in between them, <clears throat> it is going to, again, the, they are going to miss out this physical affection. In forming the emotional bonds between parents and children, this absence of physical contact due to the excessive mobile phones, it leads to what? The development of emotional distance. So the first point is reduced emotional bonding. Secondly, limited social skills. Okay, as you are observing that use of more and more mobile phones in socialization or in, uh, instead of cuddling, the use of mobile phones is leading toward the uh, uh, lack of discussion, lack of, you can say, uh, exchange of ideas. And because of that, they are lacking social skills. They have more, lesser and lesser <coughs> friend circles. The children I'm talking about, they have lesser and lesser friend circles. They are lesser and lesser aware about the new words, the language words. And they are lesser and lesser aware about the how to behave uh, in society, how to manage the, um, the family members, how to you know, treat each and every family member differently. They are lacking these limited social skills. And we are observing that the, the children especially, they are becoming emotionally more fragile. They are becoming uh, very, uh, they are irritated at the most of the times. And uh, if something happens against their will, against their mind, against their, uh, uh, let's say something like this, against their will. Okay, so you will observe how they are reacting in the families. So the children are becoming emotionally more fragile. They are becoming more arrogant as they are, they are lacking some social skills because of lack of face-to-face -face interaction and because of uh, use of more and more mobile phones in socialization. Additionally, 
isolation and loneliness is very important issue uh, because of this use of mobile phones throughout the day uh, using youtube using social media channels and watching cartoons and phones and after phones watching cartoons on tv after tv again phone and after phone again tv so this complete cycle of technology and uh, screen time you can say that if you observe the screen time of the children you will observe ki they are uh, isolating themselves from society they are isolating themselves from family members they are isolating themselves from uh, the friend circles they are isolating themselves from the parents grandparents uncle and aunts and because of that they are going to face the issue of loneliness they are going to face the issue of anxiety they are going to face the issue of depression and frustration in near future okay and if you observe uh, i personally observe ki in my in my childhood days uh, uh, i used to have a friend circle of 30 40 different friends right and uh, in each area in each every colony in my village i had uh, a different friend circle in school in my colony in different colony in different colony and that's how our social connections were large our were bonds were large and this friendship it's still existing okay the, i have the friends from my childhood still existing um, with this the same bond that we used to share these children are lacking this bond and because of that the isolation and loneliness and in case let's say we personally we observe ki in case of our frustration we have co- of course this frustration depression anxiety is part of our life and in that case who helps us these are the friends who will help us and the children those who are lacking the friend circles social connections and bonds of course they are going to face the issue of isolation and loneliness beyond that the delayed language development as uh, with the cuddling the mummy um, or even uh, mother and father they are going to uh, share some stories experiences uh, they are going to teach the children few new words new phrases and something like this they are going to talk with children and as cuddling and directly face to face talking with children by the parents it leads to what development of the language efficiency language proficiency their command on language improves but use of mobile phones more and more that to watching videos in some different language is not going to help in developing language so delayed language development is another issue that we are facing because of which the language development is getting delayed and uh, we are observing the children are not able to speak properly in their mother tongue and even in other languages and beyond that attention and concentration issues day by day we are observing ki because of the uh, real uh you can say this real culture or uh, uh, the short video culture or you can say uh, the the uh, in a real and short videos on youtube and instagram and all these things our attention level is lowering day by day you know we used to watch videos in our college days for 2 3 long hours but now we require that same data in 20 minutes 15 minutes 10 minutes or real format like 30 seconds 15 seconds so the, our attention we cannot entertain a particular topic for more than 30 seconds or 1 minute we just scroll it up right scroll down scroll down scroll down because of that our attention level is lowering and our mind is becoming very uh, you can say like it's, it's very very sensitive it's very very uh, like moving in all the directions and that's how the attention and concentration levels are lacking in day to day this is because of social media and especially among the children so ability to focus on a particular topic the ability to concentrate on a particular topic for long hours or for long time is lowering so this is another issue even the children are becoming very prone to cyber bullying and online risk and uh, there are many cases where of reading in the newspaper that uh children they are uh, uh, using the debit card credit cards of their parents without their knowledge and they are expensing their uh, uh, let's say on the video games social media and etc and few years back there was a game called as i am not able to recall that name of the game i think that was a, a blue whale something uh, in which the uh, children used to commit suicides so this is going to be very uh, important issue in the recent and upcoming years as children are becoming more and more prone to the use of mobile phones and they are not aware about how to use mobile phones sensitively how to make use of mobile phones for education and another Uh, uh, very valid purposes rather the cyber bullying and online risk are increasing and this the, the hackers you can say or the frauders online frauders they are making use of this issue or the unawareness of among the children about the cyber awareness and the internet use and that's how various cyber crimes are happening on day to day basis 
and if anything happens wrong with the children they are not able to uh, they have not ability to uh, how to handle with these issues and may it may lead to what suicides among the children especially right the cyber bullying and online risk is a very important issue that we are facing because of lack of cradling and more and more use of mobile phones so now we must highlight this issue systematically in conclusion ki yes we are not actually denying we are not rejecting the use of mobile phones uh, for children actually mobile phones is very important uh, revolution you may say especially we observed that revolution in covid era when the education was completely online and mobile phones saved the education as of the children and online education was again very important contribution that Uh, mobile phones led into the lives of the children but it is not that it is not you must not ignore the fact that the mobile phones is also a danger in some respects so the parents should be sensitized first by the government or any other ngos ki how the children can make the use of mobile phones more sensitively uh, more maturely so parents must be sensitized about the process of socialization and the agents of socialization rather the parents must be sensitized about the importance of socialization process at itself right it le- it will lead to um, let's say sensitization not only among the parents but also in complete society and that to that will lead to use of mobile phones very rationally on that lines i would like to conclude this session the technology is of course we need it this is the future of india but if we use or if we misuse the technology itself this is going to again uh, convert into disaster for the future of india thank you very much on this note i'm going to uh, bring another question in the upcoming sessions till then i would like to take a break thank you